AFTV, Julian, um, how do you look on that? Is that, is that a devastating loss? Is you know Because we're no longer top of the league now. We've been top of the league for so long, but it's advantage Man City now. Yeah, it is advantage Man City, but am I devastated? No. I was just thinking, as I walked out here, there's a lot of pessimism in the air. A lot of people are saying, we're going to crumble, it's all over, um, we've had our chance. We're crumbling a bit at the moment. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's no winning four in the last four games. But then what I thought of was I took myself back to January the 1st, 2022, a similar result and a similar performance against City, but not a similar atmosphere when we left the stadium. What we had there was loads of positivity. It was one of the most positive times that I've come out of Arsenal and had the crowd around me that was supportive of the team and that believed in what in what we did. And I'm thinking, what is the difference between January the 1st, 2022 and February the 15th, 2023? What the difference is, is we're actually a much better team than we were back then. We're playing for a bigger prize now. At that time, we wasn't really playing for a prize. We're just trying pitting ourselves against Man City and we put in a great performance. But now it's a different, totally different. You know what I mean? This is the team that, you know, they are the, the current champions. We're going to have to beat them to, to you know, we're going to have to pit them to the post if we're going to win the league. We've been in a great position. They have just now reeled us right back in. As a matter of fact, they've gone above us. And it wasn't a great performance. OK, you, 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 are, you are absolutely right. It, you know, it, it is different. It is different. What's different is we are a better team than we were back, you know, however many months ago, back in 2022. What's changed is our expectations have changed about our team because we've seen so much positivity, so much great play, so much passion that we expect so much more. And today, you came out of there and you said that was one of the worst performances that you've seen this season. The second half. OK, but overall, mm. you, you thought it was a bad mm. performance. And if you look at the result and you look at how we gave away those goals, then I would agree with you, but everything in between wasn't. And what got me and what confused me about why you thought it was such a good performance and I, sorry, why I thought it was such a good performance and you were so down on it, was I got taken with a passion. And without passion, you just have existence. And we're not just existing, we've got so much passion. The passion's in this not gonna win you the league, right? And that's what I'm saying, right? The, the display in the second half wasn't good enough. If we're going to win the league, when we come up against teams like this, we're going to have to play better. And, and it's as simple as that. And right now, we're not playing well. How do we turn it around? OK, that's where I'm going to disagree with you totally about passion not being enough to win the league. Because we already have the skill. We have the skill. We have the tactics. Today, you know, we, we weren't great because of the fact that we gave the ball away in dangerous areas three times and they capitalised because the quality of that opposition was incredible, absolutely incredible. You had two really, really good teams. One has organically grown over decades and decades, almost over a century. You know, Arsenal, 1930s, we won the league for the first time. 1940s, 1950s, Herbert Chapman, um, Allison, George Whittaker, in the 70s, Bertie Mee. In the 80s, George, George Graham. Then the great Arsene Wenger. And, th and then what are we playing? Well, we are playing a team that is a financial abomination. And that's what they are. And when, that, when th they came out and they played the Premier League music and those City fans booed, that just sums it up. Because I'm hoping, if justice is done, that they will never get to boo that Premier League anthem again because the integrity of the league will be upheld and they will be out of it. So, well, I don't think they'll be out of it this season. Can we still go in and win the league? Absolutely, and we'll win the league because we'll show passion. And what I said before that starting, at the starting 11 was I thought Arsenal would lose today, but people will write us off and they're already writing us off. I think the pressure will be off and that passion will absolutely see us through and we will win the league. It's good against evil and good will prevail. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.